We've been talking a fair bit this past year about VoIP. VoIP stands for Voice over IP, which is using your high-speed internet connection to replace your traditional phone service. It's becoming, for many people, the preferred phone service. It costs less than traditional phone service and offers much more in the way of features and flexibility. Now, the most important thing to consider if you decide to switch over from traditional phone companies to VoIP is what carrier you're going to choose because there are several options out there and you need to be sure that the one you choose is going to offer you the service and reliability that you need and expect. Well, today we're going to look at Vonage. They're the largest internet phone company in Canada and all they do is VoIP, so they've gotten very good at it. If you're considering VoIP, cost is certainly the biggest advantage. For example, you can get basic packages starting at $20 a month from Vonage. Now, these basic packages are anything but basic. All of the features that traditional phone companies charge extra for are included. For example, things like voicemail, caller ID with name, call waiting, call forwarding, three-way calling, and in-network calling, which means Vonage to Vonage calls being free. Those are all included. There's no nickel and diming you on your account. Now, I think you're going to agree. 20 bucks is a bargain for phone service, and that includes 500 minutes of local and long distance calling anywhere in Canada and the US. But I think you'll agree it's only a bargain if it fits in your life and works as well as the old system. So I thought today we could look at how VoIP fits in our home life. A lot of people think that if you sign up for new phone service, you got to give up your current phone number. Well, that's not necessarily the case with Vonage. If we go to their availability page on their website, we can submit our phone number and see if it's portable, if we can move it to our new account. So let's take a look. We'll put in a phone number, and you'll get instant feedback. Ah, our records indicate you can keep your current phone number. I'm not actually surprised. The good news is most numbers are portable. Next, we need to determine what hardware we want to use. Most Vonage accounts require a VoIP adapter. That's a little internet networking box which you plug into your existing high-speed network. And the adapter contains your phone account. So anywhere the adapter goes, your phone number goes with it. So say you want to go away on vacation or maybe you move homes or you're even a snowbird up and down to the States. All you have to do is take along your VoIP box, plug it into a high-speed connection at your destination, and your phone goes with you. It's the same number, the same voicemail, the same everything. So if you've got a 416 home number in Toronto and you spend a month visiting relatives in Calgary, well, take your adapter along. Your phone's there with you. Anyone back home in TO calling you on your 416 number, it's a local call to reach you. It's simple, it's beautiful, and it's elegant. You use your existing phone, your existing phone number, you pay less, and you have total convenience. Now, when it comes to choosing your VoIP adapter, you've got a few options. But how you set your own home network up and what you want to do with your network is going to determine which of the adapters works best for you. The first one is the most basic. It's the VTA. It's simple and compact and gets the job done. The adapter plugs into your internet connection, which is probably going to come from a router. So your ethernet cable will plug here into the adapter, just like you're plugging it into a computer for internet access. It's going to auto configure, so there's no installation process to worry about. All you really have to do is plug in your phone. Now there's two jacks here, so you can plug in a desk phone on one jack and a cordless on the other, or say you got two lines and one's a fax, then each one plugs into one of the jacks. Next up, we have the VT2442, which is for larger networks. Perhaps you've already got a wireless router in your network. This is the device that's going to work for you. If we take a look here in the back, it looks like a router because it has a router built in. We plug our internet connections in here for hardwired to our computers or to our wireless router. Internet comes in and we have two phone jacks for our phone service. Let's step into the wireless world next and take a look at Vonage's D-Link VWR wireless router which is ideal if you don't already have a wireless router in your home and you want to add wireless functionality. This setup is the same as with other adapters, except the wireless router and VoIP adapter are combined. Once again, we see wired internet comes in, we have some hardwired ethernet ports, and our phone service attaches here. Now, going wireless gives me the opportunity to start using one of these. This looks like a regular cordless phone or a cell phone, but in fact, it's the UT Starcom F1000 Wi-Fi phone, which uses my Wi-Fi network to make calls. Now, this is the first time we've looked at a Wi-Fi phone, and it configured very easily. I just turned it on, and you have a menu item to find the network. It found my network and several others. I logged onto my network, and with a few moments, 
I was up and running with my own phone. Now this has its own phone number and adapter all built into it. So now with the growth of public hotspots and city-wide Wi-Fi network coverage, this idea of Wi-Fi phones is becoming very practical. So for example, in Toronto now, a city-wide Wi-Fi network is being installed. You'll be able to use the internet to make phone calls through the whole metro area. And finally, there are also nice integrated home solutions like VTEC's IP8100, which is both an adapter and a cordless phone set. Now, earlier I said that most Vonage accounts use an adapter, but you can also get something called a soft phone. A soft phone turns your PC into your adapter. It's ideal for notebook users who travel a lot and want to take their phone with them on the road. For the most part, it's a small business solution, and we're actually going to look at it in detail in a few weeks. There's lots of options and considerations, but it's only going to take you a few minutes to figure out which one works best for you. And by the way, Vonage's online support staff is trained to walk you through the entire decision-making process. So you'll have real people to help you make the decision of what hardware is going to work best for you. So let's recap. VoIP uses our internet connection for voice calls. The main benefit is cost. But there's other benefits as well, such as convenience. You can use your existing phone, your existing phone number, or, and you can also use Wi-Fi phones. There are packages ranging from $20 to the $39.95, which is the premium plan. It's kind of the all-you-can-eat plan, and it's the one that most of us, I think, would end up getting, since there are no additional charges for any of the services that we use most. Caller ID, voicemail, call forwarding, and included in that premium unlimited package is unlimited long distance anywhere, in Canada and the US and even in parts of Europe which includes Italy, France, the UK and Ireland. So there's no doubt that the face of the telephone industry has changed significantly. And the internet's what's changed it all. Now actually while the technology itself has changed dramatically, the only real change that you should notice is the size of your phone bill at the end of the month. Oh, excuse me. Buongiorno.